Hello my little butterflies and this video is going to be my current reading concoctions. So yeah, I just, I felt like filming today and I wasn't going to film today because at first I didn't feel like it but I only had one more like pre-recorded video and I don't think I'm going to be able to record again like at all this week because I have like full work week this week so I don't think I'm going to have time to record this week like I could record when I got off tomorrow but I'm not sure if I might actually feel like doing anything when I get off tomorrow so I'm just going to film tonight to be safe um I actually want to talk about what like some things I'm currently reading right now because I'm like reading three different things right now and y'all know I don't usually read more than two things at one time and I'm actually reading two physical books at the same time and listening to an audiobook and I usually listen to a physical I usually would like read a physical book and listen to an audiobook or read a physical book and read an ebook but I never read two of the same like type of formatted books at the same time but seeing that this week was national um poetry month and this week that just passed was national library week I checked out a lot of books in the library, but majority of them were poetry books, and I had a couple of graphic novels, so it wasn't anything that was like too far out there, but I also had books that I, on my shelf, that I really wanted to read this month too. So, um, I've been reading a lot of poetry, and this one that I'm reading is so good, and I got wrapped up in it, and I kind of forgot about everything else, because it, it was so, it's good, it's like really good right now. I'm not finished yet. I have like a like maybe two more 200 pages left, but it's poetry, so like it goes by fast. But it's so good. And the book I'm talking about is Crank by Ellen Hopkins. And y'all, this book it is so fucking good. Like this is not even my book. This is a library book, and I had to page flag one of the poems because at the moment it is my favorite poem in here, and I want to quote it because it's like really, really good. I really love the po that poem. But as y'all can see, I maybe got, I have just like, a, I think I'm, I think according to good reason, I'm like 60 something percent finished. And um, I think I have like maybe like 200 and something pages left. Y'all, this book is good. I plan on finishing this tonight. I wanted to read this in one day and like finish it in a day. But when I started reading it, it was already late. So I had got tired and I can't read while I'm tired because it, it does me no good. So I kind of like put it to the side and I've been reading it. It is so good. I, I bought it to, to work with me that day. I was reading it on my on my break and I, I almost was late coming back from my lunch because I, I forgot to check the time and I was all into it with this book. But right now it is so good. I can't wait to do a review on it. And how I'm going to do my reviews this month is since I have a lot of poetry. I'm gonna like I'm not gonna do a review per book. I'm gonna kinda do like collective reviews. I'm gonna do like a poetry review and just like review the poems that I've read, the poetry books that I've read. And then since I have like the like I think four graphic novels that I, I'm gonna be reading this month, I already read one of them. Um it might just be three. I think it's just three. But I'm gonna do those in all one review too, and this is gonna be my graphic novel review. And I'm gonna just do them all in one video instead of doing a review, a video for each book since they are you know, since usually for poetry and for graphic novels, it's not necessarily a long review. I'm just going to put them all in one video. I'm going to do a poetry for my... What's funny? <laughs> I'm going to do a video for my poetry and a video for my graphic novels. So just be ready for that. That's, I'm going to have that, like, at least at the beginning of next month because I'm going to be done with them this month. So maybe the beginning of May or maybe by the end of April, depending on when I finish them. The next book that I'm reading that I kind of, like, put to the side to read Crank and I feel bad is King's Cage by Victoria ABR. Um, I started reading this. And I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, I have not read this since I did like my late night anxiety video for reading it. But um, I read the first three chapters, no the first two, I was only supposed to read one. I almost started reading the third chapter, I stopped myself. But this book is good so far, like I'm, I'm into it. But I started reading this poetry book and it, it took my mind off of this. And also the audio book I was listening to. But I'm about to be finished that tonight, and then I'm probably gonna pick this up some more. And I probably I might try to listen. I'm trying to listen to my audiobook more because this is my only issue with audiobooks is I can't read it like as fast as I would read like a physical book and read it at my pace. I have to like listen to this other person read it. And yeah, you can speed up the speeds of them of like listening to it, but it's not the same thing. But um, I need to make more time to actually sit down. And I'm not going to lie, I don't just sit down for I can sit like a whole hour and listen to audiobooks. I might sit down and tell myself I'm going to listen to a few chapters and then that's it. But when an audiobook, the audiobook I'm listening to is 13 hours. 
I think I've all together I've only listened to an hour and and that hour is I think it's like eight chapters and that's it so it does take me a little longer to get through audiobooks and other things so I need to find more time to listen to my audiobook which I should just bring that to work and I can listen to it on my breaks because my breaks are usually an hour or sometimes it's 30 minutes so it'll give me some time to actually listen to it undisturbed because you know if the earphones then no one really you know disturbs you and I can always pretend like I don't hear you but um I'm reading this right now and this is something I'm currently reading. I haven't picked it up in a few days though, but it's it's starting off really good. Um, I'm kind of excited to see when all when like all hell's gonna break loose because I know it's gonna happen at some point, and I'm excited to see when and I'm excited to see how. And I'm hoping I don't have to wait until the end of the book for all hell to break loose. So I hope it's happening soon. I want to see I want to see some people get their ass kicked like now. So right now it's turning out pretty good. The last book that I'm currently reading, which is the audio book that I talked about that I'm listening to, is And I Darken by Kirsten White. And I've only listened to an hour, which is eight chapters. And it's a little bit over an hour, but I've listened to eight chapters so far. And so far, y'all, this is so good. I have a quote, and it's like an inside joke for me. And like I just I love listening to it, how like the narrator said it and I promise y'all will burst out and say it in here. Like I said it um, like a few nights ago. And my friend I said was looking at me like, okay. I'm like, you know, it's funny. Like you would have had to, you'd have had to been there. You know, you'd have to listen to the book to laugh at it. And y'all, like, I love that part. Like I'm loving it so far. Like, am I darkening? It's so good. I'm loving it so much so far. There's so much happening. But um, right now, I can definitely say that this book is more like character driven than actually like actual plot driven stories. More of a character driven book. And um, I'm okay with that with this book. Like, usually, you really want a good plot. But I, I'm actually liking it being character driven because there's so many like issues that are like deep rooted in these characters. It's like drama. Like, like reality TV kind of like drama so I'm enjoying it I'm actually this is like one of the first books I've actually read that I enjoy being strictly like character driven and not really all that much plot driven because I can't I can't even tell y'all what the plot the whole point of the story is like the plot like like the plot of it but I can definitely tell you the issues going on between the characters so this is definitely a character driven story and I actually like it so I can reading right now that I'm currently reading that's my current reading concoction I have going on um hopefully by the end of the week I'll be done since this is right now it's Monday so it's the beginning of the week so by the end of the week hopefully I'm done with I'm gonna say two of these books because I'm definitely finishing crank tonight today because that's happening that's gonna be done today and if I really sit down and read King's Cage, I could be done with King's Cage by the, either the end of this week or beginning of next week. But I'm definitely, I'm, I'm not going to promise y'all that I'm going to be done with this audiobook this week. Because um, it does take me a lot longer to get through audiobooks than like regular books. So I doubt I'm going to be done with that this week. So I'm being optimistic about Crank and King's Cage. And I'm probably going to read a graphic novel at some point this week too. Another graphic novel and get it out of the way. I might be might read too because I could read a graphic novel in one day. Like that's a one day job. That's not anything that's crazy and I don't need the whole day to read that just need like an hour or uh, maybe an hour and a half depending on how big it is but um thank you guys so much like this month I can see it's going to be a really good wrap up for this month so I hope y'all like stick around and listen to my wrap up and listen to my reviews because baby so far I've had a really good reading month this month so far like the, the books I've read this month so far have been really good I haven't been disappointed yet by anything so, um, yeah, that's, that's all I have for you guys today. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe to my videos. And I will see you guys later. Bye.